guys, it's Erica. We're going to be checking out G Friend Fever or Yodea. I'm super duper excited for this. I am a huge G Friend fan and it's really excited to see that they're back. I have no idea what to expect for the sound, the concept, anything. So this will be really fun, probably be really shook, but you know, that's what's fun about it. And you know, I love them so much. So yeah, let's not waste any more time with me repeating myself so you know what it's like. Okay, I see that choreography. Ooh, okay. Their Latin pop influence, very different from the G friend we know. Oh no, wait, they've done Latin pop. They're Japanese. This is their edgier concept. Every once in a while they do it. Fingertip. Can't forget about her. Wouldn't have expected it from G-Friend, but it's cool to see how they take on this sort of concept. But still stay true to G-Friend. Kill on the choreography game. And I love the sound too. It still sounds like G Friend. It's crazy. Ekumi? Ekumi? And then it kind of fits like the visuals of their music videos that they've done from their recent releases. That was pretty dope. I don't know if it's the fact that they make all their choreography look easy, or it doesn't seem as difficult to me as like the other ones have. Maybe because I'm more familiar with the dance style. Oh, that's a cool ending pose. Look at that hand. What's with this cactus? They are the cactus. It's a cool new logo. Look at that, yeah. Morgan J frame. Okay, I see you, Queen. Face laying. So, like, they did have, like, an edgier concept with, like, fingertip, and that still had, like, G friend sound and, like, concept and everything, and that was super, super, super cool. It was, like, video game. This one's really cool, too. It's, like, their take on. Not like reggaeton, I wouldn't call that reggaeton, but like more, I guess, in the that realm because they had that one Japanese release, which I can't remember the name of it, that they did take on Latin pop 
about sound and concept and it was very very pink i remember that and it looked like princesses that's what i remember i did react to it it'll be in the end screen that link um for that one but i really enjoyed it i really liked it i really like the sound it's so it still sounds like g-friend but with this sort of sound attached to it and it's so cool how they can do that to where like they didn't lose like the g-friend in them but they were able to take on this sort of like edgier concept that was like sexy and stuff and it was cool the music video was definitely with the aesthetic of the last ones that i remember seeing and it was so cool to see them do this sort of concept because i wouldn't have like expected it i mean maybe it was eventually gonna happen but like i didn't expect it and it was so cool the choreography like i said it seemed a little bit easier to me and I don't know if that's because I'm more familiar with the sort of dance style I guess that they were doing that I just like to me I'm just like I just like I'm, it seems less difficult to me but then again they make everything they do look easy and then I will react to like the choreography and the dance practice so we'll judge it then so yeah but I, I loved it it was so great I love G-Friend this <sighs> I love it go to your thoughts in the comments down below that about G-Friend's fever if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you liked me and want to see more of my videos go and hit the subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, such as my Facebook page, all the subscriptions down below. Right the end screen, share the video to your friends. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Love you, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.